As New Yorkers head to the polls, a team of volunteers will be watching over the process. Hundreds of volunteer uh, lawyers, city officials, folks from the city government who are empowered uh, to act if they see any effort at intimidation. The Election Observation Corps will move around to polling sites throughout the five boroughs to make sure voters are not being harassed or intimidated. The mayor says the writing is on the wall and he can't take any chances. The president has made very clear he is intending to try to defy the will of the voters. He's saying it out loud. And he told his partisans, you know, stand by. This is an additional layer of security separate from what the NYPD is doing. Police officers will be posted at the more than 1,200 polling sites and at the 88 locations hosting early voting, including the Barclay Center, Madison Square Garden, and Lincoln Center. But some are questioning if the election observation team is really needed. In a statement, the New York Civil Liberties Union said less than 24 hours before New Yorkers head to the polls, this program raises more questions than it answers. We need to know a lot more about what the mayor is proposing. I would rather be too vigilant and too prepared to have hundreds of people out of the polls ready to act uh, than be painfully surprised. And voters we spoke with in Harlem have mixed reaction to the monitoring. I think that it's you know, them taking safe precautions to keep everyone safe. I'm all for safe voting. I've never been through this any time in my life that people had to really watch on when they're going to vote. Of course, this is the first time the city is doing anything like this. We found out that the team, as far as that observation monitoring team, everyone's not in place. The city is still looking for volunteers. And as far as the training, well, the city law department is handling that part of it. For now, we're live in Harlem. Nicole Johnson, PIX11 News.